Hello everybody, welcome to this presentation. My name is Markus Koslik. I'm product manager at Sensopart. This presentation will give you an overview over the features of the Visor Code Reader. Visor Code Reader, the ready to use high performance component. The Visor Code Reader is dedicated for reading barcodes data matrix codes and text. Beside code reading, the Visor Code Reader can determine the quality of codes by use of standardized quality parameters. And the Code Reader is able to read text by the OCR function. The Visor Code Reader offers optimum reading performance even at difficult to read codes. This means the Visor Code Reader is able to read robustly low contrast, polluted or damaged codes. The Visor Code Reader is able to read direct marked codes and the direct marked code reading capability supports all marking technologies like printed, dot pinned or lasered codes on nearly any surface like on metal, on plastic or, or on paper. The Visor Code Reader is able to read even damaged codes. In this example we see in the middle a good code and around this good code we see several possible damages like finder pattern damage, clocking pattern damage or a quiet zone validation. On the right lower side we see a combination of all these damages and as you see the Visor code reader is able to read even this code. Visor Code Reader, the powerful set of features. Here we see just some of the codes which are possible to be read by the Visor Code Reader. So the Visor Code Reader supports all common 1D and 2D codes. The Visor Code Reader supports OCR, which is especially suitable for dotted fonts. And the Visor Code Reader supports multi-code reading, which means that more than one code of the, of the same type of code or of different types of codes can be read at the same time. Beside code reading, the Visor Code Reader is able to grade the code quality of codes. This can be done according to standardized quality parameters according ISO IEC 15415 or ISO IEC TR 29158. Here we see some application examples. On this slide we see mainly printed codes. On the left side an example from biotechnology, a printed code on transparent plastic. Here the difficulty is that the background of the code may change because the material where the code is printed is transparent. On the middle we see a pharma packaging, a printed code on paper. And on the right side we see an example from a packaging industry, a also a printed code on paper. Here we have three more application examples now from direct marked codes. On the left side an example from machine building, a dot pin code on brass. In the middle an example from automotive industry, a lasered code on steel. And on the right side an example from electronics industry, a lasered code on plastic. Beside code reading, it's very important to integrate the code reader into the process. For this, 
we need a couple of interfaces. The Visor Code Reader offers all interfaces needed for a good process integration. Beside the digital I.O., which are used to transfer binary results or to trigger the unit or to trigger the illumination, there is available a LAN interface and the LAN interface, the Ethernet interface, offers the standard protocols Ethernet IP or Profinet Conformance Class B. Beside these protocols, the LAN interface can be used for maintenance, monitoring, for viewing the statistics and for archiving of images and results via SFTP or SMB. Another feature on the LAN interface is the robot integration. The Visor code reader can be integrated into robot controls, for example, for changing parameters, for changing the brightness of the image thresholds or the working distances. Here we have an interesting feature beside the code reading. This is a string processing function. So the Visor code reader is also able to process the strings which have been read. So, so this is not necessary to do this on the PLC and it can be done directly on the code reader. In this example, we see how we can cut out a part of a string. On the first line, we see the string which has been read by the code reader. On the second line, we search for a dedicated character. In this case, it is the first zero inside this string, which is found on position four. And in the third line, we cut out all characters after the position four. And now we have a modified string, which can be sent to the PLC. Here we have a very useful accessory for the code reader. This is a polarizing filter. The polarizing filter offers good contrast even on reflecting or shiny surfaces. The polarizing filter can easily be clipped on the front on the visor. And we see here the examples on the left side. We see a shiny surface where we not can detect the characters of the text. And on the right side, we see all characters are now clearly, have a clear contrast and can be read by the OCR function. This accessory is also available in an ESD capable version. So just by clipping the accessory on the visor front, we can make the visor code reader capable for ESD critical applications. Another interesting accessory for the code reader is the multi-shot illumination. The multi-shot is a special illumination technology for reading codes on deepened or raised structures like embossed characters or engraved characters. This technology is also very good usable for data matrix codes, which are directly injected into plastic surfaces. The Visor code reader is only a small part of a big product line. The Visor product line offers beside the code reader also an object sensor for object detection and quality inspection applications, a color sensor for colored object detection or quality inspection applications, a Visor robotic which is especially equipped with interfaces for a very deep robot integration and a visor all round, which combines all these products in one unit. The complete visor product line is compatible in configuration software, 
in mounting, in the hardware variants and in the communication interface. This means if a configuration has been done for one of the Visor products, it can be used in all the other product lines. Thank you for watching this video. If you want to have more information about SensorPart, visit our homepage on sensorpart.com. Thank you. Bye.